What's up everybody, welcome back to another video. In this episode, we're gonna be talking about how to embed videos within your HTML document. And I'm gonna show you two different options that you have. Before we move on, if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, make sure to do so, so that way you can join the community and make sure to click the notification icon so that way you'll be notified whenever I release a new video. All right, so the first thing I wanna do is go into my file explorer. In the previous video, I showed you how to embed an audio file into your document. But now we're gonna create a new folder, call it video, and I'm gonna get a video and place it in here. Okay, so now we have that in our folder. All right, so now let's go to our editor. I'm gonna create a new file. First, I'm gonna copy all this to my clipboard. I'll create a new file and I'll call it video.html. I'm gonna paste this in here. I'm gonna remove the audio code that we did from a previous video, and I'm gonna change this to video. Okay, so now, the way we work with HTML5 videos is we use the video tag itself. We'll go right here. I'm gonna do my opening video tag with controls, close that. You see my editor created the closing HTML tag for video. Now inside of it, I'm gonna say source, and we're gonna put the location. We know it's in the video folder here. So type out video. And then I already have the name in my clipboard right here. And that's a uh, .mp4 file. And then we're gonna say type equals video mp4. And then we're gonna close that right there. So we have our video HTML tag here with controls. Closing tag there. Then we have our source to the video itself. Save that, let's go to the browser. Let's go here, instead of audio, I'm gonna to go to video. And now we see that we have the video embedded there. This is an embedded video from our web server or our local disk drive. You could do this similarly on your website as well. You don't need to use a third party service. Now in reality, you're gonna to wanna to use it or you're gonna to wanna to use a third party service like YouTube or Vimeo or something else because there might be performance issues if you don't have the type of resources on your server that can handle the playback of video and multiple playbacks at the same time. But if you wanted to embed a video directly, you could. So let's see how that works. 60 days of code, make coding a daily habit. So that's uh, the video element, a very basic representation of that. Let's go back to our editor. One thing you notice, actually let's go back to the browser real quick because I want to show you this again. You saw that where it started off small and then became big. Well, that's because the browser didn't know how to properly size it at first and then it corrected itself. Let's go back to our editor. To deal with that, you can put in here with, and let's say 730 height, 410. Okay, let's try that out now. Save that, go back to our browser. Let's reload. And now, every time you reload it, the browser knows automatically how to size it the way you want. Okay, now just like in the audio file, you can have different alternative files if for whatever reason the browser doesn't support it. You do the same thing here by creating another source file for it. And the file types that you can use for videos in HTML are MP4, WebM, and OGG. Now another thing you could do if you don't want to do it this way, there's another alternative way. You create your video tag. You can say controls equals controls. Then your source will be, let's grab this here. And now typically what you'll see is that if for whatever reason the browser doesn't support either video format, maybe some text will display saying your browser doesn't support ACMO5 video. And you can do the same thing for the one on top as well. Just putting a separator there. All right, so this first version over here, we have the video with the width and the height controls. The source is using this tag here for the source and closing off there. The second version is using source here, same video and closing off there. See how that works. Okay, so now you see we have two of them and this one 
a size to the full size. Let's see if we can use the width values on this as well. Okay, so let's grab this, copy it. Let's see if it works over here as well. Save that. Let's go back to the browser. Reload. And that works as well. All right, so that's how you embed videos into your HTML document. In an upcoming video, I'll show you how to embed iframes or YouTube videos into your HTML documents, which means that your server won't be doing all the processing of that video when someone clicks play. Instead, it'll be calling in an iframe from YouTube that will handle the processing of that video. That's a preferred method since it doesn't require so many server resources on your side, but in you to embed videos from a third party source. All right, so hopefully you found this video helpful. I just wanted to show you how to embed videos directly into your HTML documents using the video element itself and two different ways of doing so. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and make sure that you subscribe to the channel. That way you can be part of the community and click on the notification icon so whenever I release new videos, you'll be notified. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Happy coding.